it No gunshots, but they getting Alrighty guys, so we're back and back right where we left off in the uh, previous video of the working on my map, of working on my map, not of the working on my map, but of working on my map. Um, so we're going to try and finish these fences in this video if at all possible. We're going to see here. I'd like to be able to finish them but not sure if it'll happen in this video or not if not I'm just gonna finish them off off camera because I'm not making another video of fences for a while anyways not for a while We're almost to this end here. Okay, so now I need to copy that. Well, actually, I didn't duplicate this first. And then I'll copy all that. And then we're going to go all the way up to the top. Select end section, duplicate it. Paste all that stuff. Go negative 90. Okay, and then we'll figure out. Oops. Okay, so we need to copy that. Paste it. We need to delete that. And then we take this and we need to shorten this up to 0 0.4, no, how about 3.5, all right. So we have that row done. So now we'll go work on this row here. And then we'll go back and do the, the, uh, jeez, I can't even think of it. The in-betweens. Whatever. I'm just going back to work. <laughs> I'm going back to work on these things. It's not even gonna talk. I'm just gonna just gonna work. So then this is more or less flat. Yeah, it is flat right there. Which is cool because then this will go by a whole lot faster. Just got to keep an eye out and make sure that uh, nothing's getting too far up. And just double check that we're centered or closely centered, which we are. Not doing what I did in the last video again, where I get nearly to the end and find out I'm way off to one side. Because that's annoying.
kind of thought it was underground a ways for a second there, but I guess not. So, I mean, as you can see, we're just moving right along now because it's so flat in this spot that it's easy. But, like, here I can see we got a big uphill. That spot's mostly flat there. So is that. I mean, a lot of this is pretty flat in this area. So it helps. So wherever it's flat, you just line one fence post up and roll. It must have had a little bit of a terrain change now. We're getting close to the end over here. I just got one more field to go. That's what I think about these fences. Boring. But we're almost done with them finally. Which I'm super happy about. Well, not done totally, of course, but done for a while. While I add everything else. I wish I could make the fences, like, paintable. That would be awesome. You just paint a line, and then they'll go in that way. That'd be hilarious. If I could actually do that. But, of course, you can't. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, wait, no. I need this. I need to delete my wires off of this. Okay, well, I guess I'll just stretch these wires out a little bit. 1.1. No, 1.5. So 1.2. Alright. So then there is that whole row. Okay, so now for these, we'll start over here, I guess. So I need to flip that all the way around. And then I need to move it back there. We'll just up and down here. And then that's actually pretty dang close right there. Cool. So the reason that I always go up to the top and duplicate is because those usually have the least amount of like changes made to them. You know, like in terms of the wires going up and down or you know, wires being deleted or whatever. So, that's usually why I go to the top. Because I know that those ones have the least, least amount done to them. I think we'll be able to finish finish these fields here before this video is over. If not, I'll just keep recording until... Well, depending on how far off from done they are, then I might just like continue recording for a little bit. Uh, and I was talking to the guy that I'm getting the new dealership from, and he said he's gonna. I asked him, you know, if when he had a moment he could send it over, and he said he's gonna redo some stuff on it. So, um, I will just wait for him to do those items. I don't know what he's all planning on doing, but. to this outer edge here. We'll go for that post there, I think. That'll be kind of the closest one. 
to uh, where we'll end up. Where this fence line will end up anyways. That'll work. Alright, last post in this row here. That looks good like that. So now we'll just shorten these wires up a little bit. Okay, so now we got that little section done. That was 15, 16, 15, 33. That was like 17 fences right there. It's ridiculous. Okay, so now with this. Okay. Um, I know this end section. Oh, no. Okay, yeah, never mind. Okay, so we'll center this here some right about there. And then it can come back to right about there. And then it can come down. Actually, it can stay right where it's at. Uh, and over just a little bit more. There we go. Good enough. I see I still didn't sign out of Steam like I was going to. But oh well. Oof, this may take a little longer than I actually thought, but I'm just going to do as much as we can in this video, and then the rest I'm just going to finish off camera. Because the next video is not going to be fencing, it's going to be fields. We're going to be adding fields in the next video, no matter what is left after this video. I'm not recording another video of fencing for quite a while. I have no desire to record another video of fencing for quite some time. Annoying hill. I'm 
Negative five. Holy crap, this one's gotta go way up. Negative six point one. Oh, we're getting closer here. Closer and closer and closer and closer. But yet. Still so far. This is getting annoying now. Offline. I don't know why Steam always logs me in. Shoot. Pretty sure I need to adjust that up and down here. I don't know why every time I start my computer, Steam always logs me in automatically. Like, even if I sign off, it never used to. I'd have to, like, manually sign in. But now I have to manually sign out every time I turn my computer on and it gets annoying especially if I'm recording a video because then I get all this stuff of everybody being in games and whatever so before I, did, I was trying to make a habit of like turning it on now I have to always make a habit of turning it Get a reply to this message. See, now with this one here, I'm going to be doing it just a little bit differently. And I'll show you that in just a moment. So 
So now what I'm going to do is just keep going. But now I will go to this previous post. Control Shift C. Control D. Control Shift V. And then I go and delete that. And delete the angle post. Okay, so now I select this and figure out it's, okay, it's X. So then I go, whoops, it's X. Bam, right smack dab in the center. I guess really I didn't need to do an end section. I could have just done a post and would have been a little bit easier, I guess. But why would I think of that? Okay, so now I'm also going to go Control shift c again, because I'm going to get an end section over here. So we're going to flip it around, zero it, delete the wires, and then we're going to shoot it down over here. And put it in place. So that way all I gotta do is just bring the other fence up to it and then we'll be all set to go. got for time left okay so we'll be able to finish this one and then I'll just have to finish the rest of them off camera so it's pretty flat here now We're over 1,500 fence posts now. Well on the way to 1,600. Uh, every time I read that number, I just want to like smack my head against the wall and be like, why did you think to do fences? Why did you think to do fences? I mean, in all reality, I could go and just hit delete right now, but I've already started. I'm following through with it. Okay, we gotta go back to this previous one here and adjust it. Because that other one was going under the ground on it while I was moving it, so. Bit of a difference there. to the end here. Um, we'll just make one more. And just shorten these up. And there we go. So... Let's go like this here. Let's 
That's a whole lot of fences right there. Let's figure out how many. 1575 minus 937. That is 638 fences. That is absolutely insane. Six hundred and thirty-eight. Holy cow. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. Don't worry, this is the last video of fencing for a while. We'll get into some more fun stuff now pretty soon. Um, if you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel. Be sure to subscribe if you like what you see. Be sure to turn on the post notifications to be notified every time I upload a new video. Be sure to check out down below in the description for my PC specs, my upload schedule, as well as links to all my social medias and some other cool YouTube channels that are worth taking a look at. Thanks for watching, you guys, and as always, we'll see you tomorrow.